and welcome back to Stranded Deep, welcome back to Pacific Paradise, and welcome back to this island we find ourselves on last time, last time we came here, because we wanted to ask and answer one simple question, can our raft, our big ass raft, carry sharks from one island to another, and the answer was, sort of, we managed to get a tiger from this island back to home island, which is over there, but we had a problem with the hammerhead, now Steve Corroy was like, who, Herbert's taking uh, the petrol power motors and adding more motors to it and I'm like there is a slight problem with that because once you're on the motor you kind of on the motor you can only really operate one at a time I think however Daniel Miller was also like oh well uh, you can just add more sails the more sails you have the more torque you have you don't go faster but you get more forward momentum and I'm like that sounds like a plan also you can carry more than one shark you'll be underwater and I'm like that does not sound like a plan that sounds like a terrible plan. That sounds like the anti-plan. That sounds like, oh no, oh yes. But you'll also, you'll also be taken off of your raft. Go empty hands. Oh, you'll also be taken off your raft by other sharks in the area. They'll just come and snatch you. And I'm just like, I don't like that. I don't I really don't like that as an idea. So what we might do is go back to home island and modify the raft and see if we can up the torque. It would be interesting to see how it reacts to the gyrocopter because the gyrocopter is a bit of a physics nightmare. Um, Steve Corey was also saying, hey, why don't you find a grouper? A grouper? A dead grouper? Mm. And then put the grouper on the raft and see if it can carry that. Since we've managed to carry another raft, we've managed to carry the gyrocopter. We've managed to carry a tiger, and then we sort of didn't manage to carry the hammerhead. The hammerhead seems to want to sink, though. That is the main problem with the hammerhead. It's like, oh, you were, uh, you're trying to do some stuff there, oh, the chum. How about I sink your raft and pin it to the bottom of the world? So, from what Daniel Miller is saying, that it will float. What is the time of day? Why is it so grey? It is, uh, it was half two. So it is going to start getting grey. I'm looking for a grouper. Giant, giant fish that swims around going, Ooh, hello. I'm a giant fish. But I'm having trouble seeing one. And I think this time of day might not be the greatest for finding giant fish. Also, that guy's poisonous. Oh, that's the giant grouper. Hmm. Okay. All right. Bonk. Oh, my word. I was not expecting that. Just, just. Okay. I've never taken out one of these guys before. I wasn't expecting a, like a one-hit KO. That's insane. Oh, I'm sorry, buddy. I thought I thought there would be a bit more of a hmm, a bit more of a thing. You're a bit of a weird one. I'm pretty sure you get like a couple of large meat or one large meat off this guy. Hmm, interesting, interesting, interesting. And I don't think we can pick him up and put him in our pants. No, he's not a pantsable object. All right, we'll enjoy the fish on the screen because we do have to go back to Home Island. Uh, it is late in the day. It's probably not the best time to be trying this, but can our uh, raft, can our giant raft, you float for a little bit, don't you? Yeah, you do. Let's go up here. Oh, is he too far away? Eh. Nope. Can our giant raft carry a giant grouper? Oh, wow, that is heavy, though. Physics in this game is a little weird, and he kind of rocks and rolls around. He doesn't have jiggle bones, though, so that's kind of making me a little bit more hopeful. Okay, all right, I'll do it, I'll do it, because you asked for it. So the, the petrol motor, I, I, I actually like the petrol motor. Uh, I do like the petrol motors. They give you fine control over your forward momentum. That boy is going to bounce, isn't he? Uh-huh. Yeah, the waves, we're going into the waves again. That's a bit of a problem. And he might rock and roll. Maybe he doesn't flip us over. That could be a bit of a problem. Ooh, he is, he is rocking and rolling, but he doesn't seem to be pushing us down into the water that much. Not as much as the hammerhead was. All right. But he is pushing us into the water, definitely. Yeah. Oh my word. Oh my word, the oscillation. Yeah, the, the petrol motor, I like it because it gives you... It doesn't give you as much torque as the sails, and you can only use one of them at a time. But, 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 you do get to ease off the W key. So you get to ease off the throttle and sort of coast for a bit. So if some physics weirdness happens, then you don't just physics yourself 
into a reload of a save? Maybe question mark? Unless you're on hardcore mode, in which case your save is deleted if you happen to, I don't know, go visit Davy Jones' locker. We have a little bit of a problem. All right. So the giant group is, doesn't seem too much of a problem. Stop. Uh, stop rocking and rolling. I don't like it when you rock and roll. Of course, we've chosen the hardest way to go. We're taking cargo into into the waves. And if you're joining us for the first time, yes, the waves do travel in one direction. They go in one direction and one direction only. One night only. I'll tell you what I'm going to do. Get off you. Uh, nope, nope, nope. Let me use a sail. So we've got two sails and they go sideways. And it does allow us to move sideways a little, little strafe because this thing does not turn. Drop an anchor. Uh, whoa, 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 what was that? I saw the tail. Uh, it's a marlin. Wait, what? Why is there a marlin on my island? There should be no sharks here. Yeah, a little sailfish. It's... I mean, it's an hour and ten minutes before sunset. Um, there's not too much we can do, I'm afraid. Uh, what we could do is wait for the morning and see if the marlin is still there. I'm not entirely sure he will. I don't know. I don't know. All right, you. Uh, we have six. Mm, what? So the physics in this game is a little weird. Just a little weird. There we go. How are you? How are you? You still dead? You're still dead. Yeah, no, I've never got one out of the sea before. What a what a strange looking creature. Uh do we have a kniffy? Not on me. Oh, there might be one on the raft. We could chop him up and turn him into dinner, that'd be nice. Uh need a little torch action going on so we don't step on anything poisonous. Yes, 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 yes. I've got the torch action. I've got the poison. I've got the remedy. I don't have the remedy. Uh, there's the knife. Is the marlin still out there? Weird. I don't want to... Oh, yeah, he is. Yeah, I see his tail. All right. Okay. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. Interesting. Still there. Um, the thing about sailfish is... I know for a fact if we were to spear him now, he would just drop to the bottom of the ocean and we wouldn't... Well, we might get the body. It wouldn't drop off the map or off into the void. So let's grab some meat off this lad. How many do we get? Never tried it. Never, never tried to take out one of these lads. We get two medium meat. All right. Okay. I mean, not, not bad. Not the best, but not bad. So uh, the sun is going down on what is or was a beautiful day in paradise. A very interesting day in paradise. A very scientific day in paradise. Wonderful. So we'll grab the torch. Our torch is online. We do need to drink. So we will do that. Mmm. Delightful. A little bit more. Ah, I don't mind if I do. All right. Okay, fine. So we've done that. Uh, up here. Up, up, up. Up all the way to the top of the treehouse. Again, if you're joining us for the first time, hello and welcome. We live in a treehouse. This is like, yeah, it's just a casual thing. Someone challenges you to build. Challenges you to build a mansion. And you're like, okay, I'll build a mansion up in the trees. The trees of love. Uh, slap. Wait. I've got a bit of meat in my pants. Where did that come from? Okay. I'll put you there. There's a poison fish there. Oh, I know what we can do. Hmm. We've got... One, two, th How many did we pick up? One of three. We can only put five meat on the smoker. So we may as well drop the cod down. One, two, three. Whip the knife out. Turn the cod into meat. The interesting thing is the grouper, even though it only takes one hit to kill, or at least one hit to kill with our skills. Oh, that's interesting. So the codfish body just drops out of the world. Yeah, there it goes. It just goes straight down. I guess eventually it will hit the base of the world and then despawn. Oh yeah, weird. So you get the meat from it. Oh, that, that's a strange little thing. Well, we're, we're learning. We're learning all the time. Oh, speaking of learning, we need to relight the fire. All right, we can do that. So 
three, four, five. Is that five? Yeah, that's five. So we can take palm fronds, which, you know, we did chop a lot of wood down to build the house. It was an awful lot of lumber. Um, and so we've got a bunch of palm tops, so we can light fire with that. Palm tops and fibrous leaves. And fibrous leaves will certainly give you a renewable source of fire, uh, fire material. I was going to say firewood, and my brain was just like, it's not wood. It's what? It's fire stuff. Things to light a fire, because if you just chop all the trees down, you'll eventually run out of trees. Okay, so what we're going to do is we'll save, and then we'll sleep. And then we will wake up, and it is 4... F ah, we've lost daylight lottery again. 4.50 in the morning. Ah, drop down there. Uh, is this is cooked. That does look smoked. Okay, we'll preserve what little fuel we have left. I'll take one of the meats. We need two blocks down. No, one block down? One and a half blocks. Oh, that was, that was good enough. Right. Right, 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 right. So we're going to need to do some bits and pieces here. We're going to need to put some more sails on the raft. Do we try to do that with a hammerhead? Or do we try to... Oh, yeah, we've got to wait till the morning because the... Oh, the sailfish might still be out there. Mmm, the gyrocopter. All right, what does it take to add more sails to a raft? And do we want to do it to the big one? Maybe. I mean, it's good for science, right? And everyone's up for science. At least I assume everyone's up for science. Two sticks, uh, one lashing and one cloth. All right, so we can add one, two. One, two. Bonk, that drops. There's that. Now, here's a question. Do we... Do we move one of the motors? Is we oh. we might move a motor. Mm. We might move some things around at the back of the raft. I can't see anything. There we go. We got some stuff down here as well. So we could either move the anchor or we can move a motor. Uh, the motor can be used to steer, even if it has no fuel. So it can be used as a tiller. I thought we had more cloth down here. Weird. Oh look, the sun's about to come up. So we do have the gyrocopter, which we could put on there, because the gyrocopter acts unpredictably. If it hits the raft, it bounces around. So it might be worth trying to... Hmm. No, we'll upgrade the raft, and then we'll go back and see if we can more successfully carry a, uh, a hammerhead. And if we can, then that's great. If we can't then that's gonna be interesting and you guys have caused a bit of a problem a pain in my butt so to speak so yes the sun comes up on another beautiful day in paradise oh yeah speaking of pains in the butt um in case anyone doesn't actually watch the vlogs there is no adverts well there are no adverts on the channel but there's also no adverts on the um on the website i took the i took the adverts off the website and then replaced it with the donation button. Some people have donated, and I have to say thank you. Thank you very much. It is certainly appreciated. It's probably the most the channel has ever made in its nearly 10 years of existence now. And I don't want to think about that. I think we're coming up to... No, we're in... Yeah, we're in year 9. Um, so grab that. So yeah, thank you for that. Also, I haven't forgotten about the... About the viewer vote. So if you don't know about that... Uh, should the channel get $150 in donations in a month, which is basically impossible. But should it do that, then it goes out to a vote for the next vlog. Basically the costume that I should wear, whether it's uh, whether it's a Deep Space Nine, whether it's a Star Trek uniform, which I'm, I really do want a new Deep Space Nine uniform. And I do emphasize the new Deep Space Nine uniform as opposed to the one I had years ago. Or whether you guys vote for some Disney princess outfit. Mmm. I don't like putting things in your hands. You guys... You guys are a pain in my butt sometimes. Speaking of pain in the butt, we do need to see if that sailfish is still around. So did we get most of the bits? Lashings, that's what we need. One of seven. One of, one of eight. And we'll do it. Ooh, would you actually do that? I mean... The vlogs are filmed in the car, and this time of year is actually a, a, a super pain in the butt because uh, of all the holiday traffic. You would literally be sat, well, I would literally be sat in traffic, probably with the windows down, whilst... Hmm, I don't see him. I don't see the sailfish. Maybe it's despawned. 
I'll wait until I'll wait until it's a bit more sunny and then I'll I'll explore underwater. Um we might actually have to move this though in order to work on it, because this is kind of an awkward location. Uh, maybe we pull it into the inlet to do that? Man, maybe. That's a good idea. An excellent idea. So let's do this. Sell us forward? Forward? Bonk. Yeah, some of yeah, down I don't well, I don't know how much people know of where I live. But where I live is very touristy. In the winter there's nobody here. In the summer, there's everybody here. We got something like four million tourists in a season. Some it's a ridiculous number. It's either I mean, the standing population is something like I don't know, thirty thousand. It's crazy. So, hmm, how do we do this? Which way? Which way do we want to go? It doesn't actually matter. All right, okay. So we're gonna do some little creation. One, two lashings. Nope, can't do that because my pants are full. Why didn't you warn me? My pants are full, and we also don't have a hammer. Uh, okay, what we can do is put the material down on the beach because it doesn't need to be in the pan. One, two, three, four. I think. Oh no, that would only give us two sails. Ooh, I will try it with two, and if we if we can't do it with two, we'll add more. We'll just add more. More? More! You want more? Please, sir, I want more. Hmm, okay. Hammer, get in my pants. Uh, also, also, also... If we take some cloth with us, that will be... Uh, Tibbet's cloth, there we go. We can, we can make more on the other end. If we need it. Oh, we can just move... Oh, yeah, we can just move the sails that we have on there around. Ah! But they, uh, they do serve a good purpose. Hmm. All right, all right, all right. And we might need an actual tiller. Oh, bugger. Yeah, we might actually need, need a tiller. Uh, although it's not going to matter because I think it's raining now. So, okay, fine. Yeah, look up at the sky. Rain sprites. It's raining. That's a... Uh, speaking of pains, why is everything a pain in the ass? Everything is a pain in the ass. Do you have an ass? It's probably got pain. Pain? Pain in my ass. Uh, okay, cool. So, power. Sail. Oop, hippity hop. This way. Um, Q and E. Probably shouldn't do this while it's rocking and rolling around, but whatever. 108 days survived. Tarp wall? Don't think so. Rough sail, yes please. Okay. Let's move it. Pock, pock. Q and E. There we go. So we've got two sails on the front. Alright. Yep. We have two sails here. Now is a, a two sails so we get more torque. I think that's the plan. I'm gonna put the anchor down if it's not already down. There we go. So the, the, the plan is that adds more torque. So the two sails uh, won't make you go faster, but will will give you more beans. Uh, so we can grab these two and prep for launch. And I think if we rip uh, do we rip uh, oops rip one of the motors off. No. I think what I'd rather do is pull the pull the anchor off. It might be a better idea. So if we pull the anchor off, what we can do is put a tiller there instead. Especially while it's storming and we can't really do much anyway, so that's fine. So if you come up here, we're just kind of we're just kind of feng shuiing everything around a bit. Okay. Alright. Uh, bok. So I grab... Oops. Can you not be there? Thank you. Uh, grab this lot. Bonk. Okay. That's fine. That's fine. We can't put the... Oh, bugger. No, we can do it. We can do it. We could, we could put her back in the... Back in the water. Back in the water. Oh. Okay. So if you put a butt in the water... Right where the storm is... I, I swear the like Ben and Sam really do have to change the storm frequency. I wonder. I wonder if there's like a, a thing that I can go on and just say Ben, Sam, stop it with the storms. Every day it's raining, and I don't like it. I don't like it up them. Uh, okay, I need a hammer. I need the raft anchor because it's just in my pants and in the way. If we put it, because we can put it on the back of here, right? Um, probably want to do it in such a way. There you go. 
because if the raft is bobbing up and down what you can do is accidentally put it in a position where it's just a little bit weird right so raft is looking a bit more ha huh. it's getting a little bit more rubik's cube up in here two forward sails probably not enough can add a third but we do need a tiller uh raft rudder two sticks one cloth one lashing oh it's not actually that expensive all right all right we can do this one stick two sticks you thought it was going to be more complicated i thought it was going to be more complicated i'm going to be honest i thought oh no oh no more complicated okay uh one lashing oh we can get that from here two three and four and then just craft the lashing and then drop it on the deck because you know that's the way it works Okay, just so we know what we're doing. And if this does work, yes, maybe it would make carting the gyrocopter easier. Hmm, I'm all up making carting the gyrocopter around easier. Because that thing's a pain in my butt. Sploop, sloop, sloop. There we go, a little bit of water. Hmm, hydrated. Okay, fine. And that thing is still upside down. Oh, should really fix that at some point. Uh, speaking of which, what did we need? We needed two sticks, got the two sticks. Oh, with cloth. Cloth, cloth, cloth. Nothing down... Oh. I think we do have a loom, so we could just make cloth if we don't have it. No, there's a bit of cloth. I know we got some on the boat. Everyone's like, oh no, you've got some on the boat. Don't freaking forget that and anything, yo. And I'm like, yeah, I know, I know it's on the boat. But we were going to use that to make extra, extra, extra sails. We're going to use it to sail. Sail away. Come sail away with me. What? Nothing. Uh, I'm pretty sure if... Oh no, yeah. Yeah, we can quick craft. There we go. So we'll jump up. Mm, tiller. Pock. There we go. So the tiller, we get on and we can steer. Blup, 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 blup. Blup, 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 blup. Okay. Okay. I'm going to leave the motor on there because I, I just like petrol motors. They're really, really good. I love them. I love it. And I also realise there's a bit of cloth over there. There's been a bit of cloth over there all the time. Why didn't you use it? I don't freaking know. I don't know. What we can do, though, is use it to upgrade the raft. What? <gasps> Seriously? We can even upgrade it even more? Yeah, well, why not? I mean, we're not going anywhere. There's a freaking storm. All right, okay, let's upgrade the raft even more. Uh, vehicles. We do need, um, this. So four sticks, one cloth, one lashing. Okay, I'll do it. So we need eight sticks. I think we probably have that somewhere. Sounds like the storm's easing up, which is nice. So, ba 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 ba. What are we going to get from here? Two, three, four... Whoop. Five. Six. Whoop. Physics. Seven. Okay. So we've got seven sticks. Uh, what we're going to do is take this. Whoop. Take this. Take this. Uh, Wood stick pile. May as well make a pile. And there we go. Much better. Much better. Much better. Much better. And then one more stick. Okay, excellent. So we can go here. Oh no! I just realised something. So that's one of eight. Um, the... If the Marlin's around, it might have despawned. Oh, and a bit of cloth. There's just cloth everywhere. There's just cloth everywhere. You touching cloth? It's here! On my shoes! Right, okay. Sploosh. Marlin. I don't see it. But let's see... Yeah. Oh, no, it's here. Oh, bugger. Oh, I was not expecting that. Yeah, he's he's straight here. Hey, buddy. Uh, I got a hit. Oh, I've not seen... I've not been underwater. I've, I killed one before. He just... He just went away. He just left. He was not ready for that jelly. Huh. Okay. 
Yeah, so he took a hit and then he just pieced out. So the marlin, if you kill it, it will sink like a stone because it doesn't have the shark, uh, like, physics. The sharks, when you used to kill them, they would sink. People forget this. Sharks would just straight up sink to the bottom of the ocean and then you would not be able to find them. They would just disappear with all your stuff. And then they changed it so that sharks um, float for a little bit. So as you're going along, the sharks are just like, oh, uh, I float for a little bit, but not forever. Yeah, I was listening for the shark music. It's it's gone. It's it pieced out. Weird, strange, so super strange. Okay, fine. Um, I think it's quite late in the day. Yeah, it's nearly two o'clock again. What is what? I don't I don't like the weather. The weather effects are just too much, too much, much too much. Oh, look at that. Uh, I can craft a fibrous leaves pile. It's not what I want. I want to pick the fibrous leaves up. We need, only need one more. There we go. Oh, there we go. Right, so we can make the two lashings, we can whip out that, and then we can do an even bigger upgrade, because we were going to do this before. And then what I want... I want a can of peas. I want a can of peas. Okay, um, other way. There we go. There we go. Massive upgrade. Well, it's kind of a quality of life upgrade, so we don't get cooked by the sun. Okay, right. So we have two canopies, two canopies. Uh, food and water situation is not too bad. Do we have, uh, do we have tins of beans? We have some tin of beans, we have some meat, we have some water on us. Yeah, all right. All right, I think we can just go. I think we can just go. I was looking, I was looking with my eyes. I was working in the lab late one night. Okay. Let's get around. She does not want to steer again. Pain, ah, it's a pain in my butt. Okay. Fuck. Nope, that's the opposite of the direction that I wanted to go. I wanted to go that, um, this way? Mequis? Wait, it's Maki. It's not Mequis. Uh-huh. <laughs> Tell that to Major Barrett. Who's that? Uh, the computer voice. From Star Trek. I think, yeah, that is the island we need to go to. Alright, we'll do it. I'll do it! This is going to be ridiculous. I don't like the fact that we've fully upgraded our upgraded battle station. So we have two sails, and we also have the ingredients for two more sails. And we can add more. It does seem a little silly, though. Hmm... All right, uh, this seems dangerous. Seems super dangerous. All right, let's go back and try it. So the raft has been upgraded. We have now uh, more protection from the sun, which is the one thing that will kill us. Uh, if I hit the rocks, can I spin us round? No, yeah, almost. Well, almost, very almost. Nice. Good. Excellent. So we can just step off. Remember that there is a purple poison boy right there. So I'm just not gonna not gonna hit that. It says oh, if we do hit it, I don't think there's any PP left on the island. Oh no. Oh no, that could be a problem. What? If you if the, if you don't have any PP left. Uh yeah, if you, if your PP is gone. Oh. Huh? No, ah, Roth, come back. I need you. I want you. Let's face this direction. Okay, let's get on the raft. And then... Sploosh. Right, good. So the theory is... That these will act as... Yeah, these will these will jet us forward. And we, we couldn't build where the sails are anyway because of the motor. I suppose we could have built four sails across the front. Hmm, I don't know. We're, we're still experimenting this out. So two sails might still might not be enough to grab the noodliest of sharks. The noodle shark physics boy. Hmm. Yeah, I still don't think this is going to work. And I think what's actually going to happen is we end up 
in a disaster scenario where this thing just slams itself into the bottom of the ocean with a shark on board. But, 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 I'm going to leave it there for the time being. So if you like this, definitely leave a little like, leave a subscribe. And if you do subscribe, click the little bell because that will give you notifications when videos go live. Or alternatively, don't click the little bell because you are your own person. And I'll tell you what, I'll catch you next time. <laughs>